All right, so we've got to talk. Oh my gosh, I'm so frustrated. I am so frustrated and I'm gonna rant and I'm sorry, I'm already gonna apologize for being so passionate in this rant. But I am just so frustrated with the Oscars and I'm more frustrated at the fact that I believe we've just lost perspective altogether as to what the heck the Oscars are for. I mean, to me, movies are about meaning and all we do is, is look at a party where people get dressed up and slap each other on the back or slap each other in the face. I mean, sorry, this, I just feel like when art is made for art's sake, right? That's what the Oscars should be. And I know people don't watch these movies. Why would you watch these movies if all the point of watching these movies is for them to lead up to an award show? I mean, who cares about award shows anymore? I don't. No wonder they're irrelevant and no wonder nobody's watching the art because the art is not, there's nothing to do with the art except go to a party about it. What if the art was being made so that we could talk about the art, that we could talk about the meaning of all these great films that are being put together each year? That's what the Oscars should be. If I have my recommendation for the Academy, I'd say quit all the, the put away the crap of the show. I mean, or, or have your little show with everybody dressing up and talking about what they're, anybody's wearing and all the people behind all the movies and stuff like that. But have something where we're talking about the movies. Like, isn't that the point to focus on the movies? And to me, every year, what I've been able to see is that th these movies that are brought together, now, well, first of all, I know what people always think. Oh, well, you know, it's a bunch of liberal Hollywood with a leftist agenda and all this kind of stuff. And maybe, you know, there are movies that are definitely done with an agenda in mind. But these are our brightest and best artists who have something to say. And whenever in the past you would always have art and you would hold up the artist as the people who were actually leading the conversation, who were giving us eyes to see, binoculars to see the future, right? That's what artists were. Artists were supposed to be prophets to where we were headed. And now I don't see any of that and I don't see any reverence for that. I don't see anybody going, let's look and revere art for art's sake. Sure, entertainment's great. The box office is great. Marvel is great. All these things are great. We definitely need to be entertained. But when it comes to sorting out the meaning in our lives, which a lot of us need to have a place to sort out the meaning in our lives, and there's no place to do that with the art that's being made to do that. And so that's why every year we do these Oscar salons, you know, before the Oscar ceremony, because every year I have seen that when you put all these movies together, not each singular movie, but put all the movies together and then look at across them and see what kind of themes they have. Then even the artists didn't know that they were making movies that when you put them together, they said this thing, right? That's what I've seen. I mean, just to give you an example, you know, last night, nine of the 10 Oscar nominees had protagonists who were Gen Zers and nobody's talking about that. That was like Oscar history. If you just look across it, and none of those filmmakers meant to do that. None of those filmmakers knew, you know, five years ago when they were making, starting to make those movies that, oh, this is going to come together. And who knew that all these movies would have teenagers in them practically? I mean, nobody knew that. But when you put them together, you go, oh, wow, there may be some hope for America if we pay attention to the Oscar themes and see that all of them have these Gen Zers. What does that say for us, you know? And then even the other... Uh, themes that I came up with, like you can see how passionate I, I gotta slow down. Whew. <sighs> Even the other themes that I was talking about before the Oscar ceremony happened of territorialism and the need to discuss the issue of territorialism in our world, which is happening, oh, over the ocean right now in a war, but it happens on stage in the Oscar ceremony. Like, even if we're not gonna talk about it, it's playing out on stage. Here's a guy, you know, who's marking his territory and walking up on stage and hitting a guy. I mean, this is, I mean, you could, I can show you the movies in the Oscar ceremony that he's emulating. And then today, the morning after, guess what another theme I said last night was? We need to process culpability and figure out the whole story and ownership over the whole story. Well, guess what's happening today? We're processing the culpability of what happened last night in the ceremony. I mean, literally these themes are playing out even in the Oscar ceremony, but we need to talk about them as far as our story as a culture, 
We need to talk about what it means to help the next generation be change agents for us. We need to figure out what it looks like in these movies that are giving us pictures of ways in which we can step into the story, whether we can play characters in the story. And I just believe most of these themes I've seen in the last eight years foreshadow what we're getting ready to experience. So if we could talk about that, talk about the meaning in the movies, that's what I want. Why aren't we focused on the meaning in the movies? Oh my gosh. <sighs> I'm so passionate about this. I'm sorry. This is what I do for a living. What I do for a living is we take people's top 10 movies and we look for the meaning in their movies across the palette of their top 10 movies. And we find every single time incredibly transcendent, meaningful things that are their story. So we just, I just want to talk about our story and I want to have a forum for us to talk about it. And if you missed our video, our salon video last night, then I'm definitely going to promote that because we had this incredible speakers talking about uh, all kinds of issues uh, of us, you know, looking at uh, themes from last year. I wanted to, you know, what I want to do each year is show you a theme from last year, what last year's Oscars were, and show you how it played out, which it did. So we had speakers around that. We had sp a speaker speaking on how Gen Z can be a part of our change and our solutions as we're moving forward. Just so many important topics, but nobody's fo <laughs> we're focused on this daggum ceremony, which is irrelevant. So please, Academy, let's change. Let's wake up. Let's change things. Let's go back to what this is all about, which is art, which is artists saying something and celebrate what they're saying and process what they're saying and look for the meaning in the movies. Thank you for watching my rant.